We've got a great way to keep your hands cool when you sip your next cup of coffee. We've come up with a cute coffee koozie using Moda Mini Charm Packs. Download the pattern at Fat Quarter Shop and let me show you how to make one today. From your mini charm pack, take out six light and six dark squares and just lay them out, alternating your light and your dark. You're gonna sew them together with a quarter inch seam allowance and you're gonna press to the dark. When you've sewn them together, they will look like this. You wanna take a four and a half by 12 and a half inch rectangle of batting or just a scrap of batting and we're gonna quilt as you go and sew these together. So you're just gonna lay them down where your seam intersects, put in a pin since you're using batting, your, your fabric's gonna move around a lot more. And you're just gonna sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. And then this is how your seam looks. We've used black thread just so you can see how it looks, but at home you're gonna wanna use matching thread. You just fold it back, finger press, and just keep adding your fabric all the way down. So your piece is gonna look like this and you're gonna see you've sewn through the batting. You're gonna take a template from our free pattern and I like to cut it out around the template. And then you've got this alignment guide, these four lines and you're just gonna line them up where your seams are and just use two or three pins And then you're just going to rotary cut this out on the edge. And then with scissors, we're going to cut this other side. Now you'll just remove your template and place your template on the top of a four and a half by 12 and a half inch rectangle. Put a pin in. And then we're gonna just use a hair band and on all hair bands, there's a little crimp on the side. You wanna leave that sticking out one of the corners and you just place a pin in, hold it in place. You've got everything and we're ready to sew. You're gonna stitch all the way around a quarter inch away and we're gonna back stitch at the beginning and the ending. We're gonna leave a two inch opening for turning. And now we're ready to trim away the backing. We're just gonna trim right along the edge. Now we're gonna clip each of our corners off, just right before you're stitching. That's gonna make it easier to turn. Then you're gonna turn your koozie right side out. You're gonna have an opening. You'll just turn it under about a quarter inch, pin in place, and then you'll just top stitch an eighth of an inch around, all the way around, and that eighth of an inch is gonna catch this quarter inch seam that's been turned under. To finish your koozie, just use your cup as a guide and put a button on and just get creative with whatever button you like. And we love to put gift cards in our cup and give them as gifts. I mean, who wouldn't love a koozie with a gift card? If you like our video today, give us a thumbs up below and subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you next time.